welcome to another trailer reaction here on the Maxflix. Uh, we have the Borderlands trailer that has dropped. And um, honestly, uh, it's one of my favorite games growing up. I loved the first Borderlands when it came out. I loved the second Borderlands. I loved all of the little add-ons that they brought out as well. For those of you not familiar with the game, it's kind of like a post-apocalyptic world where... People are like just scavenging and trying to figure out how to navigate this insane world where people are like, they're insane. Most everyone on this planet is insane. Pandora. Um, and it is a, the thing that made this game so special was its humor. Yeah, there's lots of games out there like this, but this one was special because it was just so funny. There were genuinely funny characters that made you feel like you'd actually, you would laugh at these things. Um, now, game to movie adaptions have had their roller coasters of the past few years. Mostly, have, they've been terrible. Recently, we've had some really great successes. I mean, we've had like the Super Mario movie did really, really well. Um, we had obviously the Last of Us. The se the series has been just brilliant. Um, but a lot of real misses that have happened in the past with Assassin's Creed, and you know. A few others, but the the thing that always makes me nervous going to these kinds of things is if they don't adapt them properly, they can become really trash, and it makes something that you really love if you feel like a massive missed opportunity. And going into this, obviously, I've got high hopes for it because I love the games. Um, it was just really awesome because you get all kinds of guns. Um, they always were just like so unique, and again, the humor is what really made this game so cool. Um, and I saw some character posters come out um, and completely forgot. I mean, I knew that Kevin Hart was going to be in this, which made me really excited. I thought he might have been playing a tiny little uh, person from the game, but um, he's he's playing a different character. But um, Kate Blanchett was someone that I completely forgot was in this. Um, and when's the last time you saw a bad Kate Blanchett movie? Just think for a moment, because as far as I can remember, I haven't seen her act in anything that was bad. Maybe, maybe the Ocean's 8 movie, but still, like, she was great in it. She That movie wasn't bad. It was a pretty decent movie. I, I just think she's always amazing. And she's got a good eye for good scripts, and she acts in good stuff. That's really encouraging for me. Going into this, thinking, okay, cool. On top of that, they've got a pretty solid cast here. I mean, they've got uh, Florian Montenu. No idea who he is. Apparently, he was in Shang-Chi. Can't remember him. Uh, Ariana Greenblatt, which, uh, from what I understand, I think she was uh, in the Ahsoka series as the young Ahsoka. Kevin Hart and Jamie Lee Curtis. I mean, that's pretty quality. Um, this character poster looks really, uh, really cool. I mean, they, they do look a bit cosplay-y. <laughs> but I don't know how else you could do this movie without it being over the top and just full on. Jack Black is playing Claptrap, which I'm curious to see if they kind of do a voice modulator there to see if he sounds different or if he's going to be Jack Black. But Jack Black's great. I mean, put him in a robot, put him in a Kung Fu Panda, put him in Tropic Thunder, whatever. He's great. Um, and then, uh, yeah, we've got a little collection there of some people in the poster. But all right. So that, that's got me amped up pretty good. Um, I've got high expectations, potential to have high devastation as well, but let's get into this trailer and see what it's all about. Would you look at that? A ladder! Unfortunately, my design doesn't facilitate this type of... They do have the modulator, which is cool. Well, destiny awaits. Legend has it that there's this massive treasure hidden in some secret vault. Classic Borderlands. And if you go hunting for it, you'd better take any help you can get. It looks like the world of Borderlands. Because it's on the weirdest, 100 most dangerous dumpster fire of a world in the universe. God, I hate this planet. What is that smell? Pesquage gully. Ew! Put the window up! I don't want to! Roll the window up! Roll the window up! It's Pete. It's Pete. Why do you think it's called Pisswash? <laughs> How did I get the name? It's in my mouth! 
Cool, cool. Hey, it's that guy. Do you know how many people have died? Looking for this vault? We have something they don't, baby girl. Okay. What? Major issues. Time to make it rain with your body. Parts. Explosives. Boom. What did I tell you? Minimal no explosions. I said no explosions. <laughs> The action looks really solid. <laughs> Ooh, mine's bigger. What are you doing? I needed a gun. So you asked for it. There's only one of you in the world. You're special. Uh oh. Killed them all. Oh, Mad Moxie. Cool, cool soundtrack, cool song choice. What's happening right now? I'm expelling the excess lead. I can't go if you're looking at me. Ooh, actually, scrap that. I can. I really can. Actually, it's helping. Are we really waiting for this to finish? Keep looking at me. <laughs> that is everything I needed to be. Um, it looks great. It looks like a fun time. Good action, Kevin Hart. You know he's he's always funny. He's always a quirky little funny dude. I, I I have some reservations on seeing some of the other characters. I mean like the accent on um, Kate Blanchett it, it put me off a little bit, but um, she can't do anything wrong. She's just majestic. And um, Jamie Lee Curtis. Uh, interesting to see how they play her out and what kind of character she's going to be. They really captured the sense and the chaos, I think, of Borderlands, of Pandora, and just the insanity of uh, these these characters. Um, and the humor looks fun. It looks good. Um, Claptrap, he is one of those characters when you, you introduced him. I remember the first time I was like, Claptrap is so annoying. And then turns out to be one of the most endearing, lovable characters ever. <laughs> so, look, this looks... This looks great. I'm I'm excited. This isn't disappointing. It's, it hasn't given away the story, although the story is pretty simple. They're trying to unlock a vault. They're trying to get to something. There's probably going to be someone in the way. Um, I don't need this to be an Oscar-winning film for me to be happy. I just need it to be fun and crazy and chaotic. And uh, the fact that they've got some good actors to be in this makes me feel uh, that it, it, it's got potential, that maybe there's something there. It might be terrible. This movie might be terrible, but based on this, it looks good. What do you guys think? Um, are you familiar with the games? Have you played them? Does this make you excited? Does it make you feel a little bit hesitant? Were you a little bit off on this trailer? Let me know what you think.